There are too many mesh systems in the market and finding the good budget-friendly mesh system is hard. But today we are going to review MeshForce M3S whole home mesh Wi-Fi system and it cost only $150 at the time of this review and capable of covering up to 6,000 square feet. So in this review we will do Wi-Fi speed, coverage and some performance test. So please sit back, relax and enjoy the review. First let's do a quick unboxing and see its contents. The mesh system comes with three mesh units three power adapters, an ethernet cable, and a quick start guide. Now let's look at the specs. The M3S mesh is powered by dual band Wi-Fi 802.11ac standard with 2.4 GHz and 5 GHz bands. The 2.4 GHz band is capable of speed up to 300 megabits per second, and 5 GHz band supports speed up to 867 megabits per second. You can add up to 6 mesh points and can connect up to 60 devices. And in the connection options, each mesh unit has 1 gig WAN port and 1 gig LAN port with power plug-in and a reset button. So any one of the three mesh units can be used as a primary router and rest can be used as satellites. So it doesn't matter which one you plug in into your modem. So if your house is wired for it, you can connect each node to the internet hardwired so you can experience faster internet over Wi-Fi wherever the node reside. According to manufacturer description, even a single mesh unit is capable of generating a coverage area up to 2,000 square feet. With three mesh units, you can blanket an entire home with wireless coverage up to 6,000 square feet. So on the paper, it can easily cover a three-story house, eliminating Wi-Fi dead zones at homes such as bedrooms, basements, garage, and even backyard garden. It is ideal for big house, apartment, and office. Not only it can generate this full Wi-Fi coverage in your home, but it also does so with a single SSID, so you don't have to disconnect and reconnect as you move around the house, provides seamless roaming. When looking at the design, each unit resembles a small square speaker about 7 inches tall. They are all sleek white color sides, nice texture on the top, and very small footprint. Despite the small size, they are packed with powerful hardware, are we going to test to see how well they perform? Now let's do some performance coverage and speed test. So we place one of M3S router in the basement storage room. It has concrete walls around it and it is in the lowest part of the house. So for this test we are using Intel X200 Wi-Fi 6 card installed in our laptop and Apple iPhone 11 which is also equipped with Wi-Fi 6 card. Even though the mesh unit is Wi-Fi 5 standard but Wi-Fi 6 devices are backward compatible. So the total square footage of the house is 5000 square feet. I will be testing Wi-Fi connection in different corners and floors of the house to see how well M3S mesh system performs in terms of speed and coverage. In this test we will use fast.com which is powered by Netflix to perform internet speed test. So let's get started. I have 300 by 300 megabits per second Ryzen Fios internet connection and standing right next to the Wi-Fi router I'm getting full connection speed which is great confirming the Wi-Fi router is working properly. Now for the second test, I'm standing 30 feet away from the Wi-Fi router in the basement with a couple of walls between the Wi-Fi router and the phone. I have so far a solid Wi-Fi connection with still good Wi-Fi speed. Now let's move from the basement to the main floor of the house and do a third Wi-Fi speed and connection test. Now I'm standing right next to the first mesh satellite on the first floor of the house and Wi-Fi connection is still strong with good Wi-Fi speed. Now let's move to the second floor of the house and do a final Wi-Fi speed and coverage test. Here we are standing right next to the second mesh Wi-Fi satellite and we have two floors and few walls between the M3S mesh router and one floor and few walls between the first mesh Wi-Fi satellite. Here we still have good Wi-Fi signal strength with good Wi-Fi speed. Now we are going to do a backhaul Wi-Fi speed test. In this test we have our local NAS device connected to our main mesh router via Ethernet and our desktop is connected to Wi-Fi mesh satellite via Ethernet as well. In this test, we are going to transfer close to 6 GB of file over wireless backhaul connection. So as you can see, we are getting close to 30 MB per second transfer speed, and NICs on both router and satellite are 1 GB. These are impressive results considering the price point. Finally, we connect our Wi-Fi 6 AX200 laptop to the mesh system 
and confirm 5 GHz channel provide Wi-Fi bandwidth up to 867 megabits per second as advertised. Now we're going to look at how to set up this mesh system. The Mesh Force M3S system was extremely easy to set up. All you have to do is download the mobile app to your Android or iOS device. Connect Wi-Fi router to your modem, or if you have Ryzen Fios Ethernet connection, you can connect your mesh system directly to your Fios Ethernet connection. You don't need modem or Ryzen Fios router. Then just follow the instructions in the app to complete the setup. To my surprise, mesh system has very clean interface. So we're going to go over the settings very quickly to see what are the available options. On the main screen, we have mesh setup information and shows us all the connected mesh units. Also on the top, you can see internet bandwidth information and near the bottom, you can see number of connected devices. Also in the bottom, you can select mesh settings where you can find wireless settings information where you can select SSID and password. Next, we have guest network information. You can either enable or disable guest network. Next, we have parental control settings, followed by internet settings. Next, we have QoS settings, followed by options to add mesh points. Next, you can set up a fast roaming option, which means if you want your mesh units to hand over clients quickly to another. Next, you can set capacity orientation mode. It is recommended to enable these settings when you have over 30 clients connected to your mesh network. Next, we have Smart Assistant function to help connect 2.4 GHz devices for 30 minutes to help you discover them and install. Next, the Smart Setup wizard can detect the type of internet connection and complete internet setup. Next, you can check firmware updates to make sure all your mesh units have latest firmware. And in the end, we have Maintenance Schedule option. Next, you can set up Port Forwarding, UPnP, DHCP Server Configuration, followed by DNS settings. But you don't have to set up all these settings if you're not a power user. You can leave everything to default. Overall, Mesh Force M3S Wi-Fi system performed very well in this review considering the price point. The Mesh system delivers good coverage and has no problem covering 5,000 square feet house with good Wi-Fi speed in all areas of the house. I highly recommend this Mesh Wi-Fi system to anyone who is in the market for affordable budget-friendly Mesh Wi-Fi system for the whole family. Let me know what you guys think of Mesh Force M3S Wi-Fi Mesh system in the comments below. If you like this video, please like and subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon for notifications for future videos. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.